Hey y'all, hey, it's your girl Shay, and welcome, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be making some of my whipped hair butter. So if you're new here, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and let's get into this video. Now, our normal whipped hair butter, I add three different butters for this. And the first butter we're going to be adding to this mixture is our mango butter. And these are some of the benefits of mango butter. The next set of butters that we're going to be adding is shea butter and I'm going to be using the white and the yellow and this is some of the benefits of those butters as well. The last butter I'm going to be adding is cocoa butter and here are some of the benefits. Now I'm going to take these butters and I'm going to melt them and I'll be right back when they're done. Now I have the butters boiling under a double boiler on low heat. Now I put my mixing bowl inside of the deep freezer so it can get really cold so I can add the butters in to get a quick whipping process instead of waiting till the butters cool down to room temperature to get it to whip better. As you can see here, it's starting to get fluff, but I need a little bit more fluffier before adding more ingredients. The first ingredient we're going to be adding is hibiscus, and it helps with premature gray, hair loss, dandruff, and so on. The next ingredient is fenugreek. It provides moisture, stimulates hair growth, strengthens the hair strands, and softens all hair types. We're also going to be adding rosemary oil, peppermint oil, tea tree, and vitamin E. Lastly, I'm going to be adding a mixture of oils and blended oils to this mixture. Now I'm just going to scrape everything off the sides into the middle so we can start mixing everything up and get it nicely whipped. Now I'm just going to add a little bit of my fragrance oil and a tad bit more of my blended oil. And that's about it for this product. Um, we're just going to mix it up until we get it to the consistency that we want. And that is it. I'm just going to scrape the sides down so I can show you the texture of the final product. I'm so happy the way it came out. It's nice and light and airy, not too heavy on the hair, and it melts in your hand. And that is it for the product, guys. I'm just gonna put it inside these containers, and we have our whipped hair butter. I'm also gonna tap it down because I wanna make sure that I'm putting enough to fill the whole entire container. And that is it, guys. Um, if you would like to try any of these products, I'll leave the website in the description. And thank you for tuning in. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, just leave it in the comment box below. And thank you for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you later.